I think my injury brought me closer to God in many ways. Ever since I was little, I growing into the love in the game of basketball, I really do have a passion for it and a love for the game. Not only the competitiveness, the teamwork of it, just the, the game itself. Despite of all my injuries and all I've been through, it is worth it for sure. At first it was hard. It was a moment that I didn't want to learn. I didn't want to care about, but throughout the long journey, I was able to kind of dive in deep into what that truly means and the value of prioritizing God in my life. Not just going to church, not just reading something every day, but valuing it. When basketball was in the center of my life, my life felt like a roller coaster. The way I acted, the way I treated others was all dependent on basketball. And now that my life is centered in Christ, I'm able to have stability. Learn that my value isn't in how I perform, isn't in the stat sheet, but is in Christ. I talk about audience to one all the time because you can play for whoever, but they'll never be fully satisfied with how you perform. Knowing that your audience is God every single time, you know that he will constantly love you and care for you no matter how you play a game. I love the game of basketball. It's gonna be my job, hopefully my job for the next couple of years coming, but it doesn't bring me the joy that Christ has given me. I believe that God sent his only son, Jesus, to die on the cross for my sins and all the things that I've done wrong. And he's the only one that can truly bring that joy and that fulfillment in my heart and in everyone else because these worldly things, these things that we think that will bring us all these things, they, they won't. They will end one day because you're never gonna succeed every single time. You know, the best thing about this, the great news is that it's free and simply ask Jesus to be our Lord and Savior and ask him into our hearts and he will, he promises us eternal life in heaven and you know nothing can beat that